Previously on Not So Berry, it was spooky day and the girls' birthday party. Bella is a teen and Harper a child. Soon it was Julian's prom. He went to prom with Chantel. And they had their first woo-woo right after. When he got home, he aged up. And now our boy Julian graduated. And he chose to go to university. He chose computer science. Babe, just relax for a bit. You're too stressed. It's almost the day of our wedding, and my mom and dad don't want to come. I'm doing this alone. I'm sorry, babe. I know it's my fault. Your parents don't like me very much. It's all right. What are you doing? Dax, I'm busy. I can help you relax, Liz. Shut up, mister. You know I'm a perfectionist. I need to get everything done. How can I help then? Maybe I can help you with that. What do you think? Oh my god, you won't leave me alone, right? I'm gonna kill you. Hey, I was just trying to help you. Now you're turn me on. And what doesn't turn you on? A few weeks later, Liz took a pregnancy test and found out she's pregnant. She's shocked because her wedding is in a few days, but she's happy. She told Dax and he's very happy about their family growing. I can't wait to tell Harper she's having a new sibling. I hope she'll be happy about it. She has a lot of siblings already. I'm sure she will. Liz and Dax's wedding. Dax was feeling emotional. I don't know why Olive looks so annoyed. The groom and the bride are really happy. Harper doesn't know how to feel about her father's wedding. Don was crying, maybe thinking about his own wedding or probably happy that Dax found someone and he's gonna leave Olive alone. It's the couple's dance now. Everything in Dax's life seems amazing now. He got married, another kid on the way, and he moved to Willow Creek to be close to Harper. So are you enjoying the party? Yes, Dad. Aunt Barbie is looking pretty. Her name is Liz, Strawberry. I know, but Mom just calls her Barbie. Meanwhile, Don peed himself. It's almost happening with Bella. Are you happy about being a big sister? Yes, from where the babies come. I wasn't ready for this question so soon. Dax, she's your daughter. Instead of explaining where the babies come from, Liz asked if she wanted to talk to her sibling. Harper is so excited, even if she has a lot of siblings already. Now she's the big sister. So, you peed yourself there? Do you need diapers already, Grandpa? It was so embarrassing. I'm glad Dax was distracted with Harper. I can't believe I peed at his wedding. Don't torture yourself, Don. This happens sometimes. Thank you, darling.
and again. And soon she was back home. She actually enjoys being abducted. Now she can transform Sims. I guess she expected to change a lot more, but I guess that's okay. Bella and Harper were having a snowball fight. And Harper is totally winning this. Bella missed all the snowballs. Later, the girls were spending time with their mom. Julian is addicted to coffee now. He needs to survive college, right? Julian has so many things to do for college. He started with his presentation. Now that it looks perfect, he's been practicing. Don and Bella are watching him, giving him the support he needs. Bella had a want to cloud gaze with Harper. She's very protective of her little sister. Ouch. Oh my god. This hurts, Bella. You're really getting old, Don. Don, I wish you wouldn't age. Give me your other foot. Olive, I'm gonna live more if you stop this. You're killing my feet. Don't be so dramatic. Will you still love me when I get old? You're old, Don. I'll love you until we die. It's Winterfest and all the daddies are here. <laughs> Olive is making the grand meal. Father Winter gave Harper a gift. It was a Void Critter card. Now it's my turn to take care of you, Ollie. Yeah, but be careful, Don. Don't be so dramatic, honey. Is this good? It is, thank you, Don. The best thing I bought on rebate day. Agreed. I love taking care of you, Bella. Now let's get to bed. Your old man is tired. Good night, Ollie. Night dawn. So, there's this boy I'm into. I think he likes me too, but I'm not sure. What should I do? When I was having trouble with Chantel, your father helped me. If you think he likes you too, just let the things happen naturally. Bella is hating puberty. At least she loves a good skincare. Even in school, she's always taking care of her looks. <laughs> she wants to be an admired icon. She's trying to make new friends at school. After school, she went to her friend's home and Dante followed her and asked her to go to prom. She said no. Her friend, Justice, called them to eat pizza. The girls are having a slumber party. I can't believe you said no to Dante. He's hot. But I don't like him, Justice. I know, you like my stupid brother, right? You knew about this all along? Of course. You like him since we were kids, right? And are you okay? With us? I mean, if he wants it too. Of course. You would be my sister. I told you she would be okay, Bella. And look, I think he's totally into you. You do? Oh my god, I'm gonna die. It seems that I'm not the only one awake. Are you letting your beard grow now? Only if you like it. I think you look, uh, cute. Thank you Bella, you're really cute too. It's almost dawn, it's better I get back before your sister wakes up. 
Who cares about justice? I like you, Bella.